for me, the ultimate measure of success in uh, research endeavors and in scientific endeavors is uh, to create an impact on a real and, and critical problem. And sustainability is one of the, the greatest challenges that we face in the 21st century. What we've tried to do in the Tomcat Center is set up a series of programs that span all the way from um, undergraduate students to graduate students to postdoctoral fellows to budding entrepreneurs in order to support both their educational programs here on campus and also how they would translate their technologies. That's really what the Tomcat Center is, is all about. It's about creating an environment that will inspire innovation on campus. We really try to emphasize diversity, both in terms of the product that is being put out there into the world. And we also try to emphasize diversity of the entrepreneurs and the people who are starting the company. We created Antora Energy because we wanted to solve climate change. What's the best way we can have the largest positive impact on the most number of human lives? And we saw energy storage as the biggest missing piece in the clean energy puzzle. You look at wireless power systems out in the world today, for example, your cell phone, you have to align it just right. Or for electric vehicles, wireless power systems are either very expensive or slower than wired systems. So our solution is to bring wireless power into the higher frequency regime where we can make it both low cost and very high performance. The problem we're trying to solve is CO2 emissions from the industrial sector. And at Opus 12, we can take those CO2 emissions and turn them back into valuable products. Nitricity produces nitrogen fertilizer on site using just air, water, and renewable electricity. The process of power line inspections is incredibly expensive, costing millions of dollars each year. It's also incredibly dangerous as 50 linemen die in the U.S. every year in line inspections. And it's also incredibly time intensive, taking about six to seven months per inspection. And that is where we come in. We provide a software platform with our machine vision algorithms that are novel and proprietary. When it comes to extreme weather like hurricanes or tornadoes, or wildfires. Decisions can be life or death. So what we are aiming to do is improve the weather forecasting system. We invented a new type of smart weather balloon that can navigate through the atmosphere and can target these data deserts. With the Tomcat money, we were able to run some pilot projects this year alongside Cal Fire and Caltrans in Southern California. So we were able to pre-treat roughly 15 miles of roadway. So one four mile stretch of road that we treated uh, routinely has 35 to 40 fires every single year. So far with our treatment, there have been no fires this year. The batteries of today are not good enough. They're too heavy, they're too bulky, and they're unsafe. And we are commercializing a next-gen technology that really solves the core of these problems. The Innovation Transfer Program is one of the key differentiators of the Tomcat Center. We really create a system to support them take those critical first steps in taking their ideas and their discoveries and turning them into actual products. We really try to develop technologies and scientific advances to create the healthiest, happiest planet that we can possibly have.